I'm Craig Clement. I'm the Ready One to One instructional coach at Garland High School. I serve close to 200 teachers and over 2,500 students. I've also had the privilege of presenting at regional conferences such as the Region 10 Tech Conference and even national conferences such as Google Classroom Paradise at Alice Keeler. I'm very passionate about using technology to transform the learning experiences for our students, whether it's providing them with quicker and better feedback using Google Forms, collaboration with Google Slides, and then also getting teachers to work smarter and not harder in collaborating with their PLCs. The first innovative way to use Google Keep is through collaboration. So this note right here I have shared with some of my colleagues and we collaborate on our to-do list um, and we just type in like whose name, like who's in charge of that task. So principals could use this with their assistant principals for each task that they're in charge of. Uh, PLCs can use this, or you can even have students use this in a group project. So to add a collaborator, you just scroll down here and then type in the uh, person's email and then hit save. The second way to use Google Keep is through lesson planning. So lesson plans require teachers to insert their standard. So here's just a screenshot of the standard uh, from online. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit the three dots and then do grab image text. So now it took this picture and it typed it out all for me in text. So now the real useful way to integrate this is with Google Docs. So here's my lesson plan template. And then, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do Tools, Keep Notepad. And then so here are all my uh, notes. So I can take this and literally drag it right into my lesson plan template, delete out the picture. And so now it looks like I typed this standard and so teachers could save standards one each note and then drag them into the template then the last way is to give feedback so let's say this is some student work right here so uh, these notes right here you can create in Google drawings this one was just a bitmoji that I saved so you can drag this right over into the students work I'm going to resize it and then I'm also going to say wrap text so I can bring that right over here and leave feedback on student work that way. You can also use preset uh, phrases like common phrases and sentences so that we don't have to keep typing them out over and over again.